fucking born. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant cat. To all of you, American girls, it's sad to imagine a world without you. American girls, I'd like to be part of the world around you. Driving a car by the seaside, watching the world from the bright side. To all of you, Max, American you can always hide in the stall and cry. All right, life is strange. Let's go find this bathroom so we can take a poop. Pooping all day in the in the high school. With shiny smiles and plastic money. I wish I had. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When it closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing don't down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Damn, he done shot and murdered this freaking girl in the bathroom. See if these powers are gonna work. Whoa. 
What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. Okay, so I'm back in the classroom, reliving everything that just happened. I guess they're going to take me through all this again. This reminds me of the movie Butterfly Effect when the guy, I think it was Ashton Kutcher or something like that. He could like a rewind time or something or go back in time. And if the what sort of reminds me of. This is real. Shit. Can you give me an example of a photographer? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy... I might as well go all the way. Can I actually reverse time? Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes. Actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured the human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, Diane don't Arvis. freak out. Not there yet. You go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of Keep it together, people. Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Frankly, if he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. As you all know, it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first <gasps> self-portraits? I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. Girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp, re sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again process, and give him the right answer? Detail in people's faces, making them. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first? Self portraits. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everything. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your homework this week. Even if you're submitting your I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture.
I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Victoria hasn't moved from that spot. I wish I could go talk to Mr. Jefferson about what's going on, but I can't. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard on this shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to- Excuse me, uh, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. So if I can get away from this clown, I can go back to where that I girl was John shot said that and hopefully life stop is that what dude happens while you're busy making if I can get out plans. of here. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. Why would I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Because Max wants everybody to see how hit she is. Yo, Daniel. You remember that it's payday? You tease me. You know I don't tease. I hate that science class with those nerds. What's that got to do with anything? Because if you send me a picture, I won't. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Oh, I'm sorry, it's happening bitch. again. People are trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble. It's your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again. All right, so you. this dude was about to shoot this girl. But you can reverse the time or whatever. Um, Another shitty day. That's about it. This girl's gonna have some powers. I'm probably gonna keep playing this off and on. Not sure about um, if I'm gonna record or anything. But hey, anyway. Um, hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, get a copy. I think uh, I don't think it costs that much, like five bucks. Anyway, please rate, comment, subscribe. Boss out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped him out. Then trip on out of here, missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen.
The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. 